Hey guys, so as you guys can see from today's title, we are back with another video, back with another banger. Almost the end of 2022, babes, and I'm trying to get as much videos out as I can before the year close off, at least like three more before the new year, because when the new year comes, we getting more consistent, babes. We doing more than ever. Y'all see how I'm moving my hair? Yeah. <laughs> I got my natural hair out, so you know I gotta do a little moving here and there. Anyways, as you guys see from today's title, we are doing what's on my iPhone 14. I don't wanna make this video too long because it's unedited, it's very raw and uncut. And I want y'all to know all the content creator tools that I use, how I use them, you know what I'm saying, all that good stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all how and what's on my iPhone and what I use to edit my pictures, videos, and all that good stuff. So maybe make sure to close, I close all my apps to make sure you're not saying it's nothing open. Everything is closed. All right. Let's get right to the video. And we're gonna make this real fast and cute. And then we scoot over so y'all can see. I'm gonna put it right here. Okay, so first thing you see when you open my phone is a picture of me. Not too much, but too much. So we're gonna go ahead and go through these apps. Nine times out of 10, y'all already know most of this stuff and what it is. So I have a folder named Finance. I have Navy Federal Cash App, Booking.com, Wallet, Fudge It, and Georgia United. So Booking.com is very good for like when you're going out of town and you want to book hotels and stuff. You know what I'm saying? You're putting a trip with your friends or whatever. Booking.com is the app that I use to book all hotels, Airbnbs, everything. Cash App, y'all know what that is. Navy Federal is who I bank with. Wallet, y'all know what that is. Fudge it is how you budget your money. I use it, it very much helps me to budget my money. And Georgia United. Next, we got this smart home app. It controls our vacuum in the house. Milkshake is basically how you make like the link for people to like connect to your stuff. Instacart, DoorDash, y'all know we need some food. Pinterest, everybody know what Pinterest is. That's how I get all my ideas and you know, stuff that I wanna do. Files and Authenticator is basically for me to get back in my Instagram just in case somebody try to scam me and have my page. Yeah, that's what that's for. Make sure y'all get that. And down at the bottom of my phone, we have Gmail. You know what I'm saying? That's where all the wig companies hit my line. They be like, Chanel, can you do a wig for me? And they send it to my email, and that's how I respond. And for Alabama State University, you know what I'm saying, school. Then we got messages, phone, and FaceTime. And I already know what that is. Okay, then we got the camera, and then we have a calculator at the bottom. We swipe, you have music, you have editing folder, ASU folder, shopping folder, navigation, then the YouTube, and then you have Instagram, YouTube, YouTube Studio, TikTok, Snapchat, Twitter, music and switch okay so in the editing folder these are all the content creator apps that i use as a content creator slash influencer i use beauty plus ps express those are really good for pictures when you're editing pictures and your pictures are dark or you're trying to fix your blemishes they're really good for that i use pixar for my thumbnails thumbnails i use i use pixar a lot like almost every day because i'm a youtuber and i really need thumbnails and photos blah blah cap cut is what i use to edit reels if y'all don't have it go get it it's nothing to it but to do it honey these are all my reels that i have for example this is one reel that i was in the process of editing it looks so pretty ah but yeah that's that those are my reels facetune is how i edit my pictures as well for example i edited this picture on here so cute y'all see all the blemishes you can retouch makeup put makeup on the face do all that and canva is also what i use for my business on instagram i use it to make visuals and thumbnails as well for example this right here i don't know what this is but that's an example like if i'm trying to post something on instagram and i want it to be like you know in more entertaining than just like a plain background then i'll use canva so that's what's in my editing folder 
out of a mistake, I use photo math for math because sometimes I don't be knowing how to do them math problems, bruh, and I be needing help. Socratic is just like for biology and reading or any information I don't know, definition of words, I don't know what the meaning is. Google Docs is what I do to do all my essays at Alabama State. For an example, this was one of my recent um, final exams. And yeah, girl. Yeah, it's a lot. It's real long. I use this on the go every day, all day. Group me. Let me tell you about group me. Group me is for school. You know I'm saying this is the Alabama State group chat. Everybody be in here. This is how many people in there. 2,304 people. And yeah spring break um i'm planning a miami spring break make sure y'all stay tuned those vlogs come soon but yeah that's what's in my alabama state folder then we have shopping we have sheen amazon mcdonald's and alibaba why is mcdonald's in my shopping because when i go to mcdonald's i be in a free fry so i i have the app because every time you download the app you get a free fry if y'all didn't know that now you know go get y'all one then we got amazon Y'all already know what Amazon do, order me some stuff. Then we got Sheen. I don't think I have anything in my Sheen cart, but if I do, this is what I really like off Sheen. Like y'all, this is, yeah, this is what I'm getting from Sheen. I don't care how, I'm gonna get it, okay, period. We love Sheen. Alibaba is how I shop with my vendors for my business on Instagram, which is sheexotic.co. I haven't opened that business yet because I'm still chatting with some vendors trying to get all my stuff together before I open, but that is like for my vendor stuff. Then we have navigation, maps, Google Maps, and Waze. Why do I have three GPSs? I have three GPSs because maps, I use maps only for like when I really need to know like where food is that's real close to me. I use Google Maps for like what's in the area and everything. Yeah, for what's in the area. And I use Waze for like a shorter distance. So if I'm trying to go to the mall and it's too far, like it's if it said, if Waze say I'm gonna get there in 15 minutes and Google Maps say I'm gonna get there in 20 minutes, I'm gonna go with Waze. I use Waze for a, a faster route. So if y'all ever need a GPS, get Waze, cause Waze is like way faster. Okay, then we got YouTube. Period, honey. Make sure y'all, oh, what? Make sure y'all go, wow. Make sure y'all go subscribe to YouTube. I'm seeing YouTube. And Instagram, I just posted a new picture. You know what I'm seeing? Make sure you guys go like it up. I just posted a new picture. I'm not gonna show y'all all of them because y'all gotta go to see it y'all so. Do we have YouTube Studio? We're not gonna go in YouTube Studio, but basically that's how I edit my thumbnails. That's how I edit my uh um titles. And that's how you see how many people watching you, your analytics. Did I say that word right? Whatever. Analysis. That's how you see all that on YouTube Studio. TikTok. If you don't already, make sure you guys go follow me on TikTok. Period, honey. And we have Snapchat, which I don't really use like that anymore. But that's how I just keep all my hanging with my wretched friends. Let's go. That's where I keep all them videos. Basically, like close friends. Yeah, that's where I keep all them videos. Twitter. I don't really use Twitter like that. But when I do, I tweet like almost every day. Like as y'all can see, these are my tweets right here. Yeah, 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 yeah. They're my tweets. Then we got Apple Music. If you guys, if y'all don't know that y'all can follow people on Apple Music, y'all actually can. So if you scroll down right here on Apple Music and you ever want my playlist, I don't know how to look at it. But it literally tells you like who watches, like added your playlist. And they can add your playlist by your name. And this is my name on um on what you call it on apple music if y'all want it that's my name and for example it's literally supposed to show you who like who added your playlist but i don't know but anyways i have twitch my favorite twitch person is kai Sine. i have this because i watch him every day like he's really like the boy so if y'all don't know now y'all know period and then we swipe then we have Wisely, Chick-fil-A, Subcount, Band Lab, and Lotus Pattern. Wisely is another banking app that I use separate for like business deals. Like if somebody wanna send me money, that's how they send it. Okay, if y'all know what I'm saying. And then I have Chick-fil-A, don't know why I have the Chick-fil-A app. I just downloaded it to see if I can get some deals because Chick-fil-A is expensive and it got messed up. Subcount is basically how many subscribers you got on YouTube. Band Lab is how I make 
my songs and lotus lantern is what i use to control my led lights that is in this room right now so that is what's on my iphone 14. i also want to show you guys as far as the content creator editing tools i'm going to make a separate video on how to like make a reel or record one or whatever but that's what's on my iphone 14 y'all i hope you guys enjoyed this video it was real quick real simple nothing too long long overdrawn long video nobody wants that so yeah hope you guys like this video make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys next monday bye